Uh, my name is Mike Carmichael. I live in Alexandria, Indiana. I own the world's largest ball of paint. This is what's on the inside there. Just like that right there. Wow. And if you look at that picture right there, when my boy was three years old, that's number one layer on this same ball right here. Now 40 years old. This is 40 years we've been painting this thing. It weighs over, it weighs over 5,000 pounds. And if you look up there, somebody from that country has been here over the years. And in the red is how many times we've been painted that particular color. Okay. You know, up to 25,000, we're, we're a little bit behind on that. <laughs> and you guys are gonna paint, put, paint number 25,695 uh, 90, 95. 95 coat. Okay. coat. This is my second one. <clears throat> the first one is right over there in the corner. Because when I was in high school, uh, that one I, was an accident with a baseball got into some paint so I wrapped a wire around it and I just started putting uh, layer after layer and there's, I put a thousand layers on that one and a few years later I started this one okay and that's that's how I got started on it I love it we get over well this year we uh, we're over 1400 okay last year was 1466 okay and every year it gets more and more what do you enjoy the most about having this uh, meeting people yeah from every from all, all walks of life. Sure. Now, uh, the reason it's lumpy like it is is because of the weight. Mm -hmm. The weight's always pushing down on it because it don't give it enough time to dry sure. totally. Sure. So uh, occasionally I'll, I'll take in that. This is just a little piece. I'll, I'll cut little pieces off of it. And that's what they look like. That, like he like cut yeah. into it, guys. So if we want to paint it red, let's get started on okay. it. Okay, exactly. I'll give each one of you a roll. Tom Green and we were on Jim Kimball live one night. We were on a CBS Sunday morning. We're in Ripley's, believe it or not, Guinness's Book of World Records. I was trying to get in it and they turned it down four times. So I had to let them come and drill a hole through the ball and pull out a core sample. And they sent that core sample uh, to Guinness's in London. They put it under a microscope and somebody counted all the layers. I didn't ever think it would grow. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> when people come out here and paint that ball, what, is it gonna get any bigger? I never thought it would. <laughs> you, you didn't think it would get this big. <laughs> I mean, that sounds silly to say no, that, but yeah, I, just didn't, think I didn't think it was ever gonna go. I thought it would stay a baseball forever. I'm getting ready to reinforce it. I'm gonna put a strap around it. Okay. And then I'm gonna move this kind of center it. Okay. So that's because you're getting kind of close, not, not yeah, well, we're getting too room. close to the not wall. Sure. I think we got it. Wow. One of the family things that we did, me and my wife painted it several thousands of times when it was little. So she's helped me get it up, get the big too. So. In order to get them to paint it and get their picture taken, I wait until Christmas and get them all out here before they open up their presents, they gotta take them all. Yeah. 